what's been the biggest surprise for you um, over the last 10 years or so that you've been a VC? I, uh, it's a, I, I think I've been surprised at, at just the, the luck and randomness in this business, honestly. <laughs> Can, can you talk a little bit about the luck and randomness? Um, sure. I, you know, the, the, like, you know, I think it's some of these businesses, um, they, um, you know, so, some of them keep getting more interesting, but start in non-obvious places. So, you know, a, an example would be, you know, the founders of Uber are friends of mine, but when they raised the seed round, you know, Garrett, Travis was not working. Um, Garrett wow. I, it was, was basically not working. Um, neither of them thought it was a big enough company to spend their time on it, even though they were not working. And they found Ryan Graves over Twitter and made him the CEO for the seed round of the company. Um, you know, so, so that would be an example, you know, of at that time, you know, the idea, while it was interesting for them to spend some time on it, was not a big enough idea, you know, to be the Uber that we know today. Um, that, that would be on the randomness kind of side, you know, the, the luck side can be, you know, how you meet an entrepreneur, um, you know, can be, you, you know, that I'm sitting at a coffee shop and I meet the next Mark Zuckerberg or, um, you know, th there's a, there's certain elements to like, I may have a really specific point of view about Bitcoin and yet I didn't see, you know, Coinbase because, the, you know, they were in a, in a people network or the deal got done you know, in a way that I just missed the first round or the second round. And, and historically for us, since we have not kind of done a lot of growth investments, like once we've missed something, you know, in some ways we've sort of gone back and, and just looked for other things. Uh, mm. and, and so that can be quite frustrating because there's a lot of luck, I think, is sometimes involved in how things play out. We may get a market right and just end up betting on the wrong team you know, which at, the, at that time, you know, there's just, there's just a certain randomness in how some people, some companies or teams will get a lucky break in a way that another team won't. And hmm. it, it, in some ways we don't, we don't even often attribute it to like the quality of the team as much as just like life's not fair, you know, like the, the cards get dealt in different ways. And, and that definitely happens in, in these markets all the time.